Rogue agents are Satan. Well, la di da.
Hey, you! Hey, 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 hey! What do you think? It's a nice house, isn't it? You like it? I'm selling it. You want to buy it? I'm downsizing. No, no, I'm good. I used to sell houses like this all the time, okay? I sold dreams. I made lives meaningful. I'm not sure about that. How oh, much you like? You like beautiful things, though, don't you? Sure. Well, I just happen to know the most beautiful woman. You want a bouncy bouncy. Josh. Josh Bernstein. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the Josh Bernstein. Yeah, I never heard of you. Oh, well, I used to be a big deal once in real estate, and so I had my license taken away. My meal ticket. Where's the chick? I'll get to that, I'll get to that. See, it's not really, it's not really money that I'm after here. It's just, it's a little something more awkward than that. Now, Lenny Avery. He, he, he was my best friend. And now, he has taken all of my clients. All of them. Do you think that you could take out all of his for sale signs? That was easy. She's worth it, man. I love you. I'd... It started now, if I were you. This woman I got lined up, she is really something. Hey, bud, it's not me you're supposed to be harassing. Time is money. Now, every minute that you're with me, Avery is closing another sale. No fun until you get rid of those signs. That's the deal.
Shit, shit, shit! Fucking fuck. Come over now. I sure could use a Sharon costume like right now. Calling up the designer and saying like, what the fuck? Hey, Gary, can I bet your pooch? I'm a big fan. Dexy, Dexy! That's your fault, you stupid bald prick. Quick! Go on! Go after him! Well, I used to be a show and now I Come on! Do you have any idea how much that dog costs? He's on K9 antidepressants! This could send him over to
Okay, Dexy. No biting the fat people. Hey, Gary, can I pet your pooch? I'm a big fan. Dexy, Dexy! That's your fault, you stupid bald prick! Quick! Go after him! Someone call the pound! And an ambulance! Celebrity news flash! Maniac steals collar from Gary McIntosh's dog in Rockford Hills! Oh, how delightful! Mrs. Thornhill will have me sporting that in the bedroom before the week is out. <laughs> oh, I, I, I joke, of course. <laughs> we really can't thank you enough for all the effort you're going to to make our holiday so special. Ah, don't mention it. I always enjoy meeting people more chemically unbalanced than myself.
Nope. Locked. El jefe me va a matar. Puede ser. I hope you're not gonna ruin the surprise visit. No dispare, por favor. No dispare. Este gringo está loco. Just one more. Yo, that had to be a four-digit calorie burn. Any dumb moves, love birds. You'll need a lot more cosmetic surgery. Okay, whatever it is you want, man, just take it. Hello, this is Nigel. Please be quick, I'm roaming in the United States of America. It's me, you nutcase. I picked up some clothes from your friend Tyler Dixon. There's even a skid mark. What fantastic news! Wait till Mrs. Thornhill hears about this. Oh, she will be pleased as punch.
Hey, man. Fuck. What do you want? I'm your friend. I don't want anything, man. Come on, your company's good enough, huh? Same as always. Yeah, thanks. I really appreciate that. So, family ain't back yet, huh? <laughs> nope. Oh, she's a goddamn fool, man. Despite all the chaos of these last few weeks, I think I finally figured it out. I know, no. sounds ridiculous. No, actually, it does not sound ridiculous, you know? Because you, you're a killer. You know, you are a man of action. You do not sit on couches, you take scores. You're back, man. We are back, all right? All we gotta go do is bust out Brad and then we're golden, man. Franklin, he makes us multicultural. Lester makes it cyber. We're like modern America. We just get ourselves a gay friend. Bam! No, it's not it. I got money. It just makes you miserable. I want to make movies. Great. It's great. And uh, so where exactly does this leave me in the second act of your life? We're going to do this last big job. And then we're going to dissolve the partnership. This is not a game to me. All right, this is a fucking way of life. I got a fucking family. Yeah, well, I got nothing. No one gives a fuck about me. I do. Oh, fuck you. I saw your grave. I mourned you. And then it turns out that everything I fucking thought about you was wrong. Everything. You're not dead, and you're not a man. Well, what the fuck are you? I'M YOUR FUCKING NIGHTMARE! Yeah, enough with your goddamn threats! I mean, let me just ask you something, all right? Something I've been, I've been thinking about. Up in North Yankton, exactly who was buried in your place? I never gave it any thought. You know what I'm thinking? I had no clue. You treacherous piece of shit! You're fucking dead! You're fucking dead! Oh, fuck. Trevor! Hey! T! Where you going? You know where I'm going. Fuck you. You don't need to go all the way to North Yankton to find out what I can tell you over a couple beers back in my house. Come on. We'll order pizza. Fuck you. Fuck your pizza. Fuck everything it stands for. This is insanity. Oh, no. No, it's clear and reason thought. Finally. Come on. Come back. We'll talk. I'm not going to listen to another one of your lies. Hey, I'll lay it all out for you. Everything. Turn around. I'm going up there to see it for myself. You'll be disappointed. <laughs> oh, I'll be something. It'll be an anti-climax. The grave's empty. Just a bag of sand, something like that. Just smoke and mirrors. Ooh, alive! How do you do it, man? The game is up. I'm trying to save you a trip. You've done me enough favors, buddy, all right? Save your fucking breath. Trevor, come on. Fuck you, Michael. Soon enough, I will. Trevor? It's great to, uh... They're a plane I can use. Get me across country. Sure. Sure. We got one fueled up for a trip south of the border. I'm taking it. Is everything okay, man? Everything is not okay. Nothing has ever been okay, but I gotta see it for myself. I'm gonna see an old friend, all right? You're where I think you are, buddy. I don't know why I didn't see it. I guess, I guess I didn't want to. Fuck! Maybe I knew all along. I'm gonna find out for sure, and I'm gonna do something about it. There's always something wrong with that job. What went down after, I guess. I guess I wanted to believe. Fucking, fucking play circus! Idiot, idiot! 
Idiot! I'm sorry, Trevor. Thank <laughs> you.
Who you got in here, huh? As if I need to ask. Hey, you're wasting your time. Is that why you flew out here? Huh? Tell me I'm wasting my time? Go ahead, dig it up. I don't give a shit. Yeah, that's what you look like. The guy who doesn't give a shit. That's ridiculous. How long are you gonna keep lying for, Mikey, huh? When's it gonna stop? What happens in the dark comes out in the light. I'll give it a rest, Trevor. <laughs> There's nothing there. <sighs> this is it. Moment of truth. As if I didn't know. Brad! Look, we do what we gotta do to survive. This thing, it didn't work out the way it was supposed to. Oh, and how was that, huh? With Brad in the can and me in the ground, or, 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 or both of us in the coffin? Brad got shot. You saw it. He didn't make it. I got shot, I did. That's, that's it. I think the only thing that didn't go as planned was me showing up on your doorstep ten years later. Mikey, I mourned you. And I missed you. But I got a fucking family, Trevor. We were all gonna die. He did die. You reptilian motherfucker! I didn't want it to come to this. Yes, you did! You just don't have the fucking balls to do it! But I do! I got more to lose than you. Never a truer word has been spoken, brother. Now pull the fucking trigger. You ain't got the guts. Take the fucking shot! Who is that? Fuck! 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 Joe Phillips! Mr. Cho has requested a word! Hey, ho, ho, I'm not the guy you're looking for! Hey, how's it to be? Get the boyfriend! Boyfriend? Motherfucker. What am I the idiot salin ye? So, who are your pals, Trevor? Get out of the bed! Find it! You see it? Joseph, man! You're not going nowhere! You started this! More vans, of course! Trevor, you did This is it for I ain't got anything against you people. Hey, can't we do this where the weather's better? You don't want to die. You're on ice, Frick! Hey, go fuck yourself! Ah, you want a boyfriend, huh? Fuck off, you confused pieces of shit! You should have gone after the other guy! Don't 
We could have teamed up. You started this. How many guys you send up here? Oh, fool. Come on. You're making a mistake. You're way off, asshole! He's getting away! I ain't got anything against you people! You got nowhere to go, boyfriend. All right, all right. Get out the fucking car. Trevor Phillips Industries. Mr. Phillips, this is Wei Chang. You know my eldest son, Tao? Yeah, the ex-nut. Backed out of a contract we agreed on. How is he? Still learning the ropes, thank you. My friends miss you in North Yankton. I was hoping we could talk. <laughs> was that your people? Ah, oh, of course. Sorry I had to cut out. Your operation causes problem for me. I want to expand into Blaine County. But your business and your temperament prevent me from making inroads. Oh, well, too bad. I don't know what you can do about that. I've already done something. We have your lover. Whoa, 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 whoa. My lover? My Cody Santa. You live in your trailer together with the maid. And then you were alone in that big house. Well, you're clearly very close. You know, how much will you give up for his safety. <laughs> My lover! Yeah, right! It's a tough break. I never want to double-cross a friend and put him in danger, but you gotta do what you gotta do. My business ain't going anywhere. I'm serious about this. He will die. Tell him I love him dearly.
Trevor Phillips Industries. Mr. Phillips, this is Wei Chang. You know my eldest son, Tao. Oh, yeah. Massive E-head. Backed out a contract we agreed on. How is he? Still learning the ropes, thank you. We've been watching you, Phillips. Your operations causes problems with our plans for expansion. And since you're not a viable business partner... Oh, viable? What the fuck is that? We have your lover, Phillips. From the trailer. My lover? Yes, Michael DeSanta. You live with him with your maid. He's in our custody now. Give yourself up, and he will live. <laughs> okay. All right, yeah, yeah. No, of course, man. That's a, that's a tough break. I... Look, you guys deserve each other. Hold on to that fat traitor. And feel free to torture him to your heart's content. You'll save me the trouble.